Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? Welcome to my Fallout 76 Atom Shop Today video. So let's stop wasting time and take a look on what we got on the Atom Shop and then I'll show you uh, sort of a fort that I built today. <laughs> and uh, I, I don't know, I need your thoughts on this. Is it good or not? Anyway, let's go. Uh, right, so I did forget to mute myself. So first, before we go to the Atom Shop, let's mute myself. And then we so let's go what on the menu mothman bed for 150 atoms it used to cost 300 atoms all right I mean it's just a like a kiddish bed I'll put it this way because I actually bought a similar bed to this but it was unstoppables and the bed is way smaller so basically your character fits in like a hundred percent so uh, I don't know it's like I don't think I'll ever build this so I'm not even gonna buy it so not sure uh, quick question who did buy it <laughs> are you using it <laughs> I'm pretty sure a lot of people are using it because of the uh, the cult of the Mothman with all the cool stuff that we got so uh, man there's still so much stuff and I hope they will increase the budget because I scrapped my camp like I don't know like five times today before I got to build this and uh, man well I'm not buying that item so I'm not gonna display it to you and the only thing that we have in the atom shop is just that Mothman bed that's that's pretty much it <laughs> but let me show you the camp that I got it's not final but so far it does the trick. By the way, I did forget uh, to show these uh, candlesticks. They came with that bundle uh, that I bought from the Mothman. Uh, so this is sort of our Kambuya Kambuya. Actually, Vestek, Z Clan, I love you and I want to hug you all. But uh, there's almost 1,700 of us, so that's going to be hard for me to hug you all. <laughs> but. Uh, what I'm aiming at, thank you for pointing out this location, this location is great. I actually managed to farm a lot of legendaries while I was building the camp and uh, it was freaking good. I actually got a couple of three stars as well so it's a really good location. Uh, the only problem with this location is that these mutants, uh, sometimes they take down the uh, missile turns so quickly it's just insane. I had to wire them uh, like extra wires to all the time because uh, previously when I did it I had if one of them goes down everybody goes down <laughs> so I had to play around with my fort a little bit and uh, turns out I had to do some missiles on top as well because these things don't trigger those dudes and uh, they trigger only when they uh, like sort of pass this gate right here so that's a little bit annoying but because I actually wanted to have the mothman uh, sort of tree statue statues over there with some fire or like light showing them and this should be cool I mean as you can see there's the Mothman statue right there so we got the Z by the way uh, some of you guys started using the Z in their camps that's cool that's a cool idea by the way so I I did the same thing Z <laughs> symbolizes Z clan <laughs> so this is sort of the garage where you can do like building and stuff I mean crafting and stuff repairing the computer so it's like basic as basic not as much as detailed as the previous camp I guess uh, I'll do a more detailed one when I'm gonna have freaking more stash limit this is insane so the beds <laughs> uh, I made four beds for the four team squad those lights the ones that we got new ones the Mothman statue that can disappear check this out I'm playing muted so you can hear the sound that is actually make. That's cool. And over here, I had statues that look made this place look a little bit uh, horrifying. But now it's it's just a basic fort. I don't know. I'm not super happy about this. A lot of people found this cool, like surrounded by the uh, skulls that you trigger it. By the way, one one player when he was trading here, who got freaked out when I clicked on this thing and just jumped out of the, the vending machine. <laughs> So the vending machines over here, so that's cool. Uh, then we got that sort of I don't know totem statue over here. Uh, that's from the new update that we had this Tuesday. Uh, 
the last week of November, I think. <laughs> uh, well, and my, my billboards, uh, just a few of them. Now there's another one that you can build only two. And the artillery, for some reason, is not freaking working. And I don't know why. Maybe I gotta drop the ones that I have and uh, use the new ones or something. Drop. I mean, it's not working. I tried everything. It just refuses to freaking work. I mean, I know it can tell me like too close or you can't use it, but it's not working. And it has electricity. I think it's bugged or something. I mean, you see, you drop over there, bam. No artillery is available. Why? I mean, it used to work. I used to have fun. I almost blowed myself up once with that thing. <laughs> anyway. So that's pretty much it for the camp. So just a couple of water purifiers, no more alcohol, and uh, I don't know. It's sort of okay. I wanted to do better, but I know need to... Oh, Bethesda, please improve the crafting system. It's like insane. It's insane. I, I was not able to, like, for example, everything fits, but I was not able to put one thing because it was saying uh, it's floating when it's not. Then it was so, I mean, there are just so many, especially for me, uh, I'm really horrible in building camps because uh, I don't have experience from Fallout 4, <laughs> like uh, a lot of people do that I know of. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I mean, I would say my bar turned out pretty well, but it's because I invested a lot more time than I invested into this. Like maybe this thing took me around two hours three hours I don't know yeah not counting scrapping the entire thing because I redid it like five times so yeah about like two three hours the the bar took me way more I think about six maybe even more hours <laughs> so yeah that's pretty much it I mean I actually made some sales oh yeah by the way you know why I actually decided to do it this way uh, because now when people come to do a little bit of vending, player vending, I get to get those super mutants respond. And I get to take them down and sometimes there are legendaries. And uh, that helps me get more legendaries. <laughs> so yeah, that's why. Well essentially also if someone comes here, that wasn't my... I get access only to that field of mutants. I can't take those mutants out. So, uh, yeah, that's cool. <laughs> I was thinking to find a location where I can, uh, like, ask people to come and my guns take care of some dudes so I can get some loot. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, how much time we have? Shall we do a. Nah. I will not be doing a uh, battle royale in this video either because I really want to watch, continue watching the movie I was watching yesterday and uh, take some more rest because uh, I did kind of burn out a little bit. <laughs> but now it's like everything is good. So Z Clan, you know the drill. Don't forget to leave a like and please leave a comment about the camp. Uh, maybe some suggestions for improvement. But I don't know. I mean, to be honest. The budget ex limit is extremely poor, and uh, man, that just sucks. I, w I would love to make it way better, but I'm already running out of budget, and I need to keep some free budget in order, like, uh, if I'm going to be buying anything from the item shop so I can build it and show it to you. So I need to have that in mind, and uh, it's pretty tough. So yeah, I mean, something like that for now. <laughs> I'm gonna make a few photos just for the memory. <laughs> Alright folks, thanks a lot for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And as I said, don't forget to leave that like. Leave your comments down below because I always get back to you. And uh, thank you for watching. You have a good morning, day, and night. Whatever you guys like it at. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye. Like. <laughs> um. Okay. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I, I thought I saw everything. <laughs> Woo.
Woohoo! <laughs> uh.